Hey there and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be showing you on how to get iOS Instagram using ST Insta Pro version. So make sure to watch till the end. So as you can see here, I currently have no Instagram app because I already uninstalled my original one. And this time, open the link on description and open that link. So you need to download these two files, extract the zip file, and then you need to install this SD Insta Pro app. So here after installing, let's now open the application. What's good in this version is that we don't have to manually activate the developer options in this version because some of the features were already customized in this app. So here as you can see in our interface, the logos at the bottom are in gray style which is known to be the iOS style version for Nista. And also in our developer options, all of the features were already activated so no need to customize. So as you can see here, this is my account. And the font is still a default style as well as the emojis. Now this time go to settings, click chat screen. So here you can now change the background of your chats or conversations. You may select a photo from your gallery and apply. So here's how to do it. Now let's go to privacy settings. So you can now view profiles and stories safely through these features. You may turn on or off them based on your preference. And also go to enhancement, turn on all the improvement for photo reels and IGTV quality. It will let you share stories and photos in high quality definition. Now let's click on miscellaneous. So as you can see here, you can now change your app icon to a different style based on what you like. So let's select this one and change your font style to different iOS fonts. But remember that you can only use one font at a time. So this time, let's use this iOS strong and then restart the app to save the font changes. So here, the font changed into a strong iOS style. And of course, you can still revert or change it to a different font. Just go to the settings, click font style, and this time let's select the iOS bold or semi bold font. Then click restart. So, as you can see here, we are now enjoying the iOS style Instagram with iOS bold font. This time, let's try to share this reel on our story. So remember, we didn't change any um, settings and the developer options, but we can now share reels in iOS style, as well as add text in the iOS bold font. So here's how it looks like. And if you can clearly see, the timer is also in iOS font style. So here our font and conversations are also in what font we have applied the iOS font. And this time let's reshare this story. So just tap the photo and you can now share the mentioned story in full screen. To make it in iOS style, you need to use the extracted photos from the zip file, which is the borders for resharing mentioned story. So as you can see here, just fit the frame to the reshared story and ta-da you got the iOS sharing feature on your Instagram so the reel and photo were already shared in story and here's how it looks like as well as the mentioned story iOS bold font timer on reels and iOS 
Plus font style on the username of the shared story. But it doesn't end there, we can now change the font again to iOS style, go to miscellaneous. Select font style, and this time choose the iOS 17.4 emojis. And then, restart the app. Since the iOS emojis was applied, the iOS bold font will be removed, but you can now use the iOS emojis on your DMs, comments, and posts. So here I originally have Android emojis, but when sent on the Instagram app, it changes to iOS style. This time, let's try it on stories. See, the iOS emojis are now working on stories. And it will also be applied to all of the fonts available on your Instagram story. here's how it looks like when shared to your story so that's it subscribe for more